Welcome Wanderers. Now this is a video you'll definitely want to see. We're going to invite you to a magical land filled with princes and princesses, maybe a mouse or two, a duck. What else might they see here? All fun things, but it's one of the most unique uh, theme parks in the whole wide world. Welcome to Disney Sea, the only ocean theme park in the world. Here in Tokyo, there are two different Disney parks. One is Disney World. Oh, no, scratch that. One is Disneyland, and it is honestly what we've heard more geared towards smaller children, so we really got a hidden dash there. But Disney Sea is supposed to be more unique. So since he's still little, we figured Disney Sea it is. Now, if you're already wondering where Dash is, well, in true Dash fashion, when we get to something epic, this is typically how it starts out. That's right, passed out. He is asleep. And also, if you're wondering what we're gonna do with Dash while we're here, because some of the theme parks are typically geared towards older people, um, older individuals, not people, but um, Disney has mapped out an entire itinerary for parents with children three and under and it's on their website and it's pretty cool we're going to follow some of those some of the itinerary today we'll show you around um, and hop on some of the rides that are age appropriate for dash now it is definitely no surprise the first ride we come to has a line that is how long, Lauren? 160 minutes. 160 minutes! It's so long. Like it wraps around this area forever. It, you can see it right here, right? It just goes on and on and on and on and on and on and on. Honestly, I think it's longer than 160 minutes, but uh, I think they just probably stopped counting in 160 minutes because it looks like it wrapped around half the park. And for context, we're here on a Wednesday morning. We got here about an hour after they opened, so I'm assuming these people have been here for a while. and you're wondering what the heck is Disney Sea? Well, the biggest difference is that at Disney Sea, it's built around seven aquatic themed areas and it overlooks Tokyo Bay, which gives it a very unique appearance. We'll show really you a little pretty. bit. It really, really is. It's, it's definitely unlike any Disney theme park you will visit around the world. It opened its doors originally in 2001 and it became one of the most highly regarded Disney parks in the world and also one of the most visited theme parks in the world and as you can see from the traffic here today we it believe that is. we believe that <laughs> how kid friendly it is. Obviously you expect that in Disney, but this scene behind me where all these strollers are just hanging out, no locks, bags on them, everything. This is super normal. Um, so it's one of the safest countries in the world and you can see that people just aren't worried about this stuff. It's really neat. But designated stroller areas are awesome.
I can see directly behind me is the Columbia and just over this wall here, right here, you can see it peeking above is Tokyo Bay. It's really cool, they've done a great job there. has no idea what's about to go down. Okay, Dash does not even know what is about to happen as soon as he wakes up from his nap. So one of the things that's really neat about Disney Sea is it has some unique characters that we wouldn't see back in the US. One set of those is Duffy and Friends. So we're gonna be Duffy family today. Duffy is a cute little bear with a sailor hat and we're gonna have to do a little more research about that when we get home because Dash is about to turn into a Duffy bear. Yes, there's even a Dada Duffy rocking some ears. One of the really cool things about the timing of us getting to come here to Disney Sea is it's their 40th year anniversary. So they're about to do a celebration of colors to celebrate that. And I have no idea what it's going to be like, but. It's Daddy of ears on? Yeah? There aren't a ton of vegan or vegetarian options here. Uh, so we got what they had. Pizza, tomato basil, and churros, which obviously Dash wants to start with dessert. <laughs> Is it good? Yeah. Writing home about the pizza, but it's an option, so that's a win. Look! Wah! Wah! Making it rain, sugar! <laughs> Making it rain, powdered sugar! Now, before we get like 400 comments about the pizza, um, I already know my New York family's gonna chime in and they're gonna be like, that's not real pizza. Um, it's called long pizza here. So it's um, clearly a little bit uh, different of a shape. The crust is, uh, but the filling part of it's edible. 
that's about the best I can say about the long pizzas here. I'm gonna shoot it to you straight. So wouldn't be my, uh, wouldn't get my highest recommendation. Uh, but then again, you know, we're sort of pizza snobs. So on a positive note, Dash loves it. Disney magic. You like your bear outfit? He loved it in the bathroom. Oh, it's the cutest bear ever. You went down? Ready to go bear show. <laughs> Dash, that's so cool. I literally can't stop smiling. Um, we already stick out, especially Dash, because he has blonde hair and hazel eyes here. But you put that bear costume on him, and he is pulling a crowd. Uh, specifically, the ladies. And they're loving them some Dash. <laughs> it's adorable. Look at this. <laughs> Are you excited about going on the ride? Woo! First ride! It's first ride. Dash, are you excited? It's first ride ever in any park. He looks a little sleepy, Sue. Yeah, he does. For your This is exciting. Right, Dash. First, what do you think? First impressions. What do you think, buddy? <laughs> first ride ever. What do you think? <laughs> I think he looks shell shocked. He's like, I don't even know. I don't even know. Do you wanna? Did you like it? Here is one of my. I would say must know pro tips about visiting Japan. Uh, back in the States, we're always used to walking paths on the right, uh, but here you would walk on the left. And it's definitely, definitely apparent here in Tokyo, Disney, where everybody's walking on the left, and then you have you know, the other traffic coming on the right side. That also applies to how people drive here as well, so just uh, be aware of that. And the steering wheel, yes, the steering wheel, yes, is also on the right side, so. A little bit different than we're used to back in the States, but uh, if you don't know it by the time you get here, you'll figure it out real fast. After the ride, Dash got a little fired up, and this is our current status.
What's it say? That was one of the rides we wanted to ride today. This is the railway, but it's closed for improvements. Uh oh. Dang it, Disney Sea! There's not too many rides we can ride here with a toddler. This is one of them. And I definitely wanted to check out the American waterfront, which is where this takes us here. But uh, maybe next time. And one more thing, I know this is, isn't always apparent with our videos, but uh, Disney Sea is absolutely not sponsoring this video. So we're just giving it to you straight. If we like something, we'll tell you. If we think it's uh, kind of, we'll tell you as well. Kind of like the pizza was, you know, but, uh, Overall, we we're having a great time. Dash is having a great time. I got a little whoop, 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 on that little uh, kid's ride. Hate to say it, I have motion sickness. So at some point, I'm just gonna have to avoid all rides. I know I'm not alone in that. We've talked about this before. Now back to our Disney Sea adventures. You want to get on the ride? Did you like it, Dash? Was that fun? Dash, was that fun? He's been saying more for like every five seconds. <laughs> He's still okay. staring at it. So okay, so impression of the ride? That was hilarious. As soon as we got close enough for Dash to realize that we could get on it, he started crying. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and literally like whimpered until we got on the ride. Like, it's hilarious. He likes the fast track. That's, what can you say? Yeah, oh he prefers the fast track. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> Here's another interesting fact that I just found out. The average Disney Tokyo visitor spends between 10 and 12,000 yen and of that 10 to 12,000 yen 37% of it is spent on merchandise and if you have a keen set of eyes if you're watching the content here and I'm walking through the park you can see that almost everybody here in the park either brought merchandise or they're buying merchandise when they get here so it's pretty wild the stores here 
are packed full of people buying stuff. Fun, buddy? <laughs> After another 12 rounds on the carousel, we continued to explore the park. Wow, Lorna Daskin on this ride. Yet another ride that just goes in circles. I don't do that. Um, I found this pretty cool viewing area here. So when they're on the ride, I'll be able to capture some footage, which is pretty cool. Not just for you watching, but uh, if you're coming here and you want to capture some video of your kids and family, there's like an upstairs patio area just for viewing your family. How was it? Two thumbs up. Yeah. More. More. <laughs> Dash, was that so much fun? It's trying to go back. friendly day. Disney Sea was a blast. It's an absolute feast for the eyes and just honestly something really different, especially if you've been to a lot of the different Disney parks. It was a blast. But until next week, friend, make sure you wander local because as you know, it's good for the soul. You want to wave goodbye to everybody? Say bye-bye. See you next time, friends.